Module 6 of the HSC Biology Syllabus is all about genetic change. The main driver of genetic change is mutation to genomes, so it's really important that we understand this process of mutation. So mutation is defined as any factor which induces a genetic change to the DNA sequence of an organism's genome. There are two main categories of mutation. We can have small point mutations, or we can have larger chromosomal mutations. Let's start with point mutations. Essentially, we're introducing a small change to one or a few nucleotides in the organism's genome. These changes might be insertion of base pairs, deletion of base pairs, or substitution of base pairs. The result of these changes can be categorized into three different categories. We can have missense mutations, meaning that we get an introduction of a different amino acid into the polypeptide chain. We can have nonsense mutation, meaning that we have an early stop codon introduced, which will cut the polypeptide chain short. And we can also have silent mutations, where there's no actual change to the amino acid sequence in the polypeptide chain. Moving on to chromosomal mutations, these are changes to larger segments of entire chromosomes. You can get chunks of DNA moving around in four different ways. You may have duplication, so copying of segments of DNA, inversion, meaning that a part of the DNA is kind of flipped upside down, translocation, meaning that one segment of DNA is moved to another part of a chromosome, or you could have deletion, where an entire segment of a chromosome is just cut out entirely. You could also have mutations to the numbers of chromosomes. For example, you might have three copies of chromosome number 21 instead of the normal two, and this can influence the development of disorders such as Down syndrome. So why is understanding these mutations important? Well, as I said before, mutation is one of the driving forces of genetic change, and we need genetic change to have variation in a population. As we know from year 11, variation is essential for allowing evolution of a species. We get new alleles arising, and it means that in the future, we'll be able to adapt to new situations. Thanks, guys. <laughs>